that took some effort, but we're done. So we're now back down to the shell. Obviously, that was put in before. I'm going to uh, spruce that up rather than throw it, use it. And uh, give the floor a nice quick tidy. Give it a quick jet wash out. Get rid of all the plaster and all the dirt, all the dust. And then give it all a quick spruce up. Not bad. That's took over about an hour and a half to do all that. It's looking good. What I've done now before I swept it out is took, there was a plaque along there that sat above it. And as you can see, there's dust galore in there. So I've took all that off. I've took all the trim off the outside of here, the rubber trim. I've also done the same around here. There's a rubber trim there. I've just took it off the edge. It will go back on, but I want to clean all in between there because it does get gunk in and it does, it is water. Um, and I also took the step off there. Now these screws are just basically simple screws, but they will be uh, quite matted in there. So I suggest you just spray a bit of WD-40 on them first and they'll come out quite easy. So now that it's like that, I'm going to get that last piece of wood out and then I'm going to give this a good clean up. We have the uh, floor, flooring. So as I say, you take that all out in one. You lay the other ply down, you can just draw around it. And it just gets damp on the edges, so it is worth changing. It's got the two sides there as well. That's as much dust and debris as I can get out of there. What I'm going to do now is pull this insulation out the bottom so it don't get wet. I am going to keep it now. And I'm going to pressure wash from the front to the back and get all that dirt up and get it clean. Take the front seats out first. Take the mat out so that I can do the front as well. Remove the front seats. It's basically four torque screws. 
one, two, and the other two, the other side of it. And then you just lift this straight out. Now, it will be attached with a seat belt in the center here, which all comes out in one, I believe. I'm just checking that, yep. So yeah, we've got a built-in seat belt system there. So it should come out easy enough. As it stands, we took the bottom out, took all the ply out. I'm not going to bother taking that carpet up. I'm going to hoover in between and wash it down later on. But for now, I'm going to uh, pull this out, pressure wash the back and get it all clean again. Got the majority off, these are just scratches. I'm just gonna clean up these trims. 